The first truckload of plantains collected from various farm gates in the countryside arrived at the Accra office of the ministry at about 3 p.m. Government workers and some members from the general public waited patiently for the commencement of the sale. When the gate to the ministry was finally opened, there was a mad rush by the buyers. Everyone was eyeing the biggest bunch of plantains. According to them, the price is far better compared to the ones on the market. Frankly speaking, this is really cheap as compared to the one in town. The whole bunch is sold for 10 cities and it's very cheap in the market. Because look at it. It's a whole, it's 20 cities and it's very cheap. Because in the market you don't get it like this. Yes, I with my mother, my grandmother and my aunties. And a friend of mine, I've called her, she's on her way coming. But because of traffic, I have to buy for her. That's why I'm here. And they are delaying me. Mm. Yes. The pricing is good for you? It's better. It's far better. 20 cities, I can spend like two to three hours, uh, three weeks for, for one. So it's not going to be plantain week? No, no, it's not going to be plantain. I let yam is coming, other things are coming. So I'm buying plantain today. Then Monday or Friday, I buy the rest. The press secretary to the minister, Issa al Hassan Redwan, said the move is aimed at cushioning Ghanaians against the current economic crunch and mitigating the impact of rising food prices. It's been very difficult since 3 p.m. because the, the consignment arrived around 3 p.m. and we started selling. We haven't even offloaded a quarter of it, but we realized that there was stampede. Even though we've made sure every single plantain has been accounted for, there have been stampede. So that's why we had to reorganize. And if you, if you like, we want to heap as much as we can and sort them out. We sort it in, five, in three phases. We're looking at 25, 20, 15, and 10. That's four phases. But we're having a lot of challenges with stampede. That's why we are trying to reorganize and make sure everybody that comes here, we want to assure them that any single person that comes here can go with as much as four bunches if they want. He added, the program will last until there is no food on the farms around the country. Trucks loaded with yams and local rice will arrive next week Tuesday. The sector minister, Dr. Awusui Fuyekutu, engaging farmers in the western north region on Monday observed that prices of foodstuffs increased to about tenfold when they are transported to the capital. Joseph Armstrong, Good Alibi TV3, Accra.